My name is uh, Kenyon Kluge. I'm from Santa Cruz, California. I'm the team owner and rider for K Squared Racing. I'm also the team manager and rider for Zero Motorcycles Racing. If you want to find out more information about me, you can look at my website, ksquaredracing.com, or for more information on Zero Motorcycles, go to zeromotorcycles.com. And now I'm going to talk to you about motorcycles. If you want to start road racing motorcycles, uh, I would recommend first uh, doing quite a, quite a number of uh, track days, uh, become very comfortable on the racetrack. Uh, one of the advantages that we have nowadays is our track days are, are plentiful and very affordable, so um, there's no reason not to, uh, to do a lot of them and to be very comfortable on the track before you even think you're going to start racing. From there, uh, you need to just figure out who your local uh, race organization is. Um, you do this by asking your local track day or asking at local tracks, um, find out who they are. Some examples might be uh, AFM, uh, CCS, ARMA, um, AMA. Uh, so uh, ask around and find out who your local organization is. Uh, and then from there, you need to figure out uh, how to get licensed by that organization. Uh, some of them will have their own racer schools where you sign up and uh, attend their classroom time and, uh, and then go through a test and some on-track um, experience with an instructor to make sure that you're certified. Um, others will have you go to a track day where, where the same thing will happen, but you'll do it in a track day environment with instructors of that particular track day organizer. Once you've done that, you need to make sure that um, your gear and bike uh, adhere to all of the race regulations. So a lot of times uh, this means um, safety wiring your motorcycle, replacing your water with, uh, or your, your coolant with water or water wetter, um, making sure you have race tires, you know, running uh, uh, the proper oil and, um, and that everything's set up and has race body work and numbers on your motorcycle. Uh, so once you've got all that, all your equipment and all your everything, um, you can go get certified, get licensed, um, and then uh, head out to the next uh, race meet. Um, going there, I would advise going on the forums and talking to, to some of the other racers uh, and asking all the questions about what to expect, uh, which races you should run um, as getting started. And, um, and really any advice that, that your local racer can give you. I'm most, most of them are perfectly willing to talk to you and can offer you a lot more information than you can just get uh, online or reading forums. Um, and sometimes they'll help you out on your first race weekend out. Uh, and then, you know, set your goals. Your first goal should just be to finish a race.